it were up to me, you'd be rotting ass. Oh set. my god, no, so no! <laughs> Dobby's not even waking up for this, that's how unenthused she is. Hi you dolls, welcome back, and if you are new, hello, my name is Jessie, and today we're going to react to the trailer for After Everything, the final chapter. I am intrigued by this, I am very interested to see what we see in the trailer. Now, I have never read any of the books still. I was going to, and there's just so much toxic chaos in them that I don't know if I want to dive into that kind of a thing. Like, there's so many of them, and I feel like the movies are all I can handle right now. Now, the first one, I liked it. The second one, I liked it. The third one, it lost me. I'm not gonna lie, it lost me. It was so freaking cringy. It was too much. But I gotta see how it ends, right? I gotta see how it ends. So let's jump in before we do. Uh, don't forget to the right. And like, or just like if you do, do not like what you see. But comment down below. Let me know why. Subscribe if you haven't yet. We do fun things here. Ring the link that must be notified when I upload new videos. And don't forget to check the link down in the description for my Patreon. It is $5 a month. It's only $1.25 a week. It has all of my unedited reactions of everything that I do on YouTube. And dish more. Don't forget to follow us on all social media at star underscore ship underscore productions or at Jesse Dobby for Twitter. I actually just watched Beautiful Disaster. I loved it. I love those kinds of movies, these kinds of movies. Beautiful Disaster was fantastic in my opinion, so I hope they make more of those. But without further ado, this is my official reaction to the trailer for After Everything. Oh, you opened your eyes. Okay, maybe you are more interested than I thought. And it's the Amazon Prime, which is interesting. Are we getting it for free? What ifs and hypotheticals don't really matter in the end, do they? Nothing matters in this world. Tessa. Tessa's not here. I hope you're making progress in the new book. Everyone is dying to see it, and I'm afraid I can't keep putting people off. You can't rush greatness, can you? I can when I've given you a quarter million dollar advance. I can. I Nancy over Christmas. She asked after you. She moved to Lisbon. Lisbon. Oh god, so we're gonna go stalk her. That's what we're gonna do. This sounds about right. What are you doing? Who? Making amends. You need to leave. I really wish I could just go back. I've moved on, and so should you. I know who you are. If it were up to me, you'd be rotting ass. Oh sad. my god, no, so no! <laughs> so I just end up ruining everything instead. If I didn't have her, I wouldn't have the book. But if I didn't have the book, no. then I would still have her. No, that just ruined it for me, I'm done. You can't just talk about us like that. I can't imagine living another moment on this earth without you by my side, Tess. You really piss me off. Don't tell me. Let's sleep together now. God, that guy. Without you, there is only me. Broken, lost, and alone. It's easy to believe our ability to love is finite, especially when your heart is broken. Believe it or not, slowly, you will heal. You never know how lucky you are to spend the rest of your lives with the other half of your soul until you've had to spend your life without them. October 6th. You know, so what happened with Tessa? Yeah, I don't know. I think I'm good. Like, I'm gonna watch it, but... Meh. What was this guy's name? Ugh, Robbie and I watched it, and it was so cringy. I always finish movies. Like, I always, always, always finish. No matter how bad they are, I started it, I'm gonna finish it. I could not finish this one. Well, no, the that's a lie. The first one, I, like, powered through, and it was really hard, but it was short. The second one, I just, like, I couldn't do I couldn't do it. Bella Thorne was in it. I can't even remember the name. That's it. Wait. Midnight Sun. No. Midnight Sun was actually good. What am I talking about? I actually like that, Midnight Sun. A lot of people gave it <laughs> I liked it. Like, was it so bad they didn't even put it on, they didn't even put it on her IMDb? I had to have missed it. Benjamin Mescolo. Time is up. That, okay. So... 
So time is up. If you read this, the synopsis, an accident will force Vivian and Royan to come to a stop and reclaim their lives one minute at a time and finally start living in a present that perhaps will prove to be more exciting than predefined. Okay, that's not the synopsis I feel like I read when I saw it on Amazon, but it, it sounded really good, right? So we watch it and it was terrible. Like, I like Bella Thorne in, um, in The Babysitter. She was really, really good. She is terrible in this. He is even worse. It was just so freaking cringy, and there's, like, no chemistry there between the two of them. I stumbled across Time Is Up on Amazon Prime and Game of Love on Netflix, and I clicked it, and I'm like, oh my god, it's them again. And then I'm like, oh my god, it's the sequel. Well, the time is up and we were like 15 minutes in and I just looked at Robbie and I was like we've been tricked I fast forwarded through the entire movie because it was just so freaking awful and then as if that wasn't bad enough I looked it up because I needed to know who he was I was like he is I'm not kidding I, I I don't like to be mean but in my honest opinion he is one of the worst actors that I've ever seen in my life he's just horrible like dude you're gorgeous you should not be acting and i looked it up and they were engaged <laughs> so i'm like okay the chemistry is just not there at all and you were engaged that makes it so much worse so the fact that benjamin muscolo's in it literally just brought it down like 30 notches for me i'm gonna watch it Again, I need to see how it ends, of course. I just don't know what happened. Like, the first one was like, okay, that was pretty good. It was, it was a little weird, but it was good. And the second one I actually really liked. I was like, the second one was great. The third one, I was like, what am I watching? And that's what I feel when I watch this teaser for that, or this trailer, rather. I'm like, what, what, what is just happening? It, it's almost like they have to end it, and they don't know how, so they're just throwing a bunch of stuff together now. I don't know, but again, I'm gonna watch it October 6th, and it's on Prime Video this time, so um, I guess maybe if you have Prime, you don't have to pay for it, which would be nice, because I'm, I'm not going to, so. <laughs> but Beautiful Disaster, I'm telling you, Beautiful Disaster did not disappoint, it was very good, go check that out. Dobby fell back asleep, I don't blame her, and until the next reaction, so long everyone, try to make someone smile today, you never know when they might need it next. <gasps> Bye!